We are in the third chapter of Proverbs this week, and hopefully you're taking each night and reading that chapter so that we can walk along this together. And each day we've taken a look at what God is saying to us. One thing that we learned in time and over time is that the shortest distance between two points is a straight line. In fact, if you want to get somewhere, the quickest way to go is just straight down that path. God's Word actually tells us in chapter 3 of Proverbs, it says to us that in all things we want to keep our path straight. And the reason we want to keep our path straight is because it's very easy to get off the path that God intends for us. Now, you may say to yourself, listen, my path has been winding and I know God has been along this way and I could see Him over and over and over. And I would tell you that, guess what? You're probably correct. But the reason that you got off the path is because you lost your focus on God. And then on that path, you found where God was. And to get you back to that path, you listen to God. Then the next thing you know, you found yourself off the path again. Why is that? Because you lost your focus on God. But had you stayed focused on God the entire time, you would have seen that the path is straight. Part of the wisdom that He gives us is to focus upon where we are with Him and to rest in Him along that path. Now, a long, long, long time ago, we did a principle of the path. In fact, Jay's going to give you the link here to go back to that so you can watch the power of the path and that principle. But in the end of the day, who is it that you are relying on to lead you in each step, to lead you in each moment, to lead you in each breath, to lead you as you come across people? Is it yourself or resting in God? Only you can answer that question. Only I can answer that question. 